what can I say? Um, it's 23 to 3 right now. Um, I think it's 225 left. Giants are up 23 to 3. So uh, I'm just going to get this out the way. Congratulations to the New York Giant fans, the Blake Boo Commission, Giants Mafia. Y'all beat us in every aspect of the game offense, defense, special teams, coaching. And 49ers, we just didn't show up to play. So, you know, impressive win for you guys. Congratulations. Uh, shout out to you guys. New York Giant Pride, Copizzle, Striker, and, you know, everybody else out there, you know, Giant fans. Um, maybe we'll do it again in January. So, until then, good luck the rest of the year. As far as the 49ers are concerned, I'm going to be really short about this because, you know, because i got to get ready for a San Francisco Giants game one against the uh, St. Louis Cardinals. But, again, we just didn't show up to play today. Al Smith looked like old Al Smith. Three interceptions. He just didn't have it today. And I know I've been raving about him all year, but the one thing you got to understand about me is, if you fucking up like Alex Smith did, he wasn't the only one. This was a team effort. But if you had the shitty game like Alex Smith did, then I'm going to call you out. It's just plain simple as that. And he just didn't have it today. And until Alex Smith can figure out how to win these type of games on a constant basis, nobody's going to take him serious. He's just going to be known as a game manager. But... You know, nothing to do but move on. Defensively, we couldn't stop Eli Manning. Victor Cruz just abused Carlos Rogers all game. And Eli Manning was on his game like he pretty much always is, it seems like, when he plays the 49ers. And it just wasn't us today. We didn't really do anything special teams. Um, you know, second half, we were starting the second half, we were down 10-3, gave up a big kickoff return to open things off, and that's where things just pretty much went down south there. Um, yeah, this, this was just horrible today. Um, I'm not in panic mode yet. Um, 70% of the shit that I'm telling you right now has to pertain to this game. 30% is maybe worrying about the future or whatever. But I'm just mainly talking about this game, just shitty performance out there. And I know we're a much better team than what we showed out there. And for whatever reason, we just came out flat everywhere. Um, Frank Gore wasn't really a factor in the game. Again, like I told you, Alex Smith, shitty-ass game. Uh, Crabtree was a non-factor. Randy Moss had a big catch, but nothing special. Uh, the one thing that was confusing me was, okay, I love the fact that we were trying to utilize Kaepernick, but if we're going to utilize him, I don't understand some of the situations that we were putting him in. If... Um, I mean, if you were going to put him out there, you know, maybe a series or whatever, but this, like, play here, play there, whatever, and, you know, if you want to see, like, what he can do on a drive or whatever, that's cool. Go ahead and do that. But when you put, keep putting a man in a play here and there, and, and the situation that we were in, because, you know, after a while we were just playing catch-up pretty much all game. So if you're going to put in Kaepernick, put him in for a series, see what he can do. But all this play here, play there bullshit, I mean, in, in the situation that we were in today, I, I just didn't understand it, but that's just me. So, again, Niner Empire, we got our, we flat out got our asses whipped. It's still 23-3, two minutes left, and look like the Giants are going to try to you know, tack on three, so, you know, that's all I got. I'm out of here, about to get ready for the San Francisco Giants game. 
Um, again, congrats to the the New York Giant fans. Uh, you took it to us. Really good job out there. I was really impressed with you guys. So, um, yeah, good luck to the rest of the way. All right, Niner Empire. I'll give it to you next time. Late.